morning from Alton Harbour Hotel. Now, from what I've seen of Alton Harbour, it is literally just this hotel. There's a house over there. There's a lot of, there's a bit of stuff going on. But apart from that, that is it. I'll put a picture of last night, how dark it was, and a picture of that car. Because literally, I do not believe there's anything around it for about 40 miles. Literally, we were driving for, it, I think, honestly, I think it was about 20 odd miles, literally, that we were driving for just to get here. I took a picture, there was not, there was like hardly a light inside. And literally, even this morning, there's nothing, there's, you can't hear anything, see anything. About three cars went past in the time it took me to have breakfast. There's nothing you can hear. Alright, oh, maybe not. So all the room numbers here are like different names, they haven't got numbers on it. Instead of obviously just having a million room numbers, which is cool to be fair, so. My handwriting isn't the best, I've been told. So, it is snowing. Uh, I don't know, is it snowing? Is it sleet? It, it, there's definitely snow on the ground. But, that was a really interesting hotel, to be fair. It was like, it was quite cold, to be fair. Uh, but it were honestly it were brilliant. They all had different names and room n numbers and stuff. Like they didn't have room numbers. They had names and stuff. But honestly, what like they, they, it was just like what two people on, like that, that worked there. It were brilliant. I really enjoyed it. It was like the most unique hotel. I put that in the review. But now it is snowing. We are. We were just saying actually how far away from other civilizations that that place is. You can't just nip to the shops or nip to anywhere. Honestly, it's really cool. But. sunny weather we've had places that look like it could be switzerland places like it could be america and now i feel like we could be in sweden on to more open roads more flowy roads not roads with snow on them or people coming the other way and there's only like that much road there it's just like single track but we're back on the road today really enjoying this trip honestly it's been brilliant anyone who wants to do the North Coast 500 i would really genuinely recommend it because it's it, 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 it is brilliant honestly it's like honestly it's got cars and it's, the hotels are brilliant stuff like that it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. a lot less um camper vans and stuff like that um on the roads and stuff like that a lot less like holiday people at the moment i think it's more on the west coast people do it but obviously we're still doing that i think we're, i don't know where we are now to be fair going down the east coast but yeah there's a bridge in a minute it's really good honestly this is sick bridge now we are very very close to Inverness as you can see on the map here uh, and yeah pretty much well I think we're gonna get some fuel now and then we're going down the east coast so that should be very good to be fair uh, but still we are um, still driving the roads are a little bit more normal now to be honest um, obviously up there it was like when we were in the north it was like proper like normal kind of stuff um, or like not normal, you know, it's just like you roads you wouldn't really get anywhere else. Like now, this could be, you know, anywhere else. But it, I was saying it was. It, it, it's, we've had places like Switzerland. We've had places like Utah. We've had places like Sweden when it was snowing. Like honestly, it's been mad, and it's all within Scotland. It's brilliant. If anyone wants to do it, you should do it definitely. But now we are. It's pretty long bridge, this. To be fair, like it's not a river I'd want to swim across. Literally, I just want to travel now. I just want to. I'd love to be then now going to Switzerland to do some stuff, make a video, and then have like three spare days. So uh, you know, I might as well just like fly to Turkey or something and do some filming there, that kind of thing. But it has been entertaining, and I hope it's been entertaining. The videos I've been making, obviously, we're going to be vlogging today. I'll vlog tomorrow. Then we're going down Monday. I think we're dropping this car off somewhere for service or something. So that should be good. I'll film that. I'll get courtesy car, see what we get. So yeah pretty much it has been really really good but like i said i want to do a lot more videos now i wish i could just like get a flight to romania and just like see what's going on but you know but anyway we're still going flying through scotland down towards inverness 
So I believe that is Inverness. We're going in now. We're going to get some fuel. Obviously, he's put fuel in the car if it wants to drive. Um, and yeah, pretty much. You get a lot of people looking at the car. I drove past someone then. And you were like looking in. I was like that. And I was looking up. And I thought like, I was going to like go like that. Because most people do. And I was like, well, maybe I look a bit like I'm, you know, like, I don't know. It's, you're not going to go out about your own car. So I didn't. But then I thought I'm just staring at him anyway. Inverness Football Stadium. I wish there was a game going on, could have watched it. But yeah, that's quite cool. Next home game, I will. But yeah, I want to get to a Celtic v Rangers game one day, so if anyone can get me a ticket, I'll get the train up, I'll drive up somewhere. In fact, I might do that actually. I'll have a look at the fixtures. Might be like going into next year, but. Put the pants on ice. I was bad like Mike. Oh, now I'm good like Kendra said, boy, we gon' be alright. Oh, I just double my price. Yeah, I get love on sight. So I am at the Three Bridges Cafe, and the Three Bridges are ah, over there, what you can't really see. But pretty good food. Had a panini and that. Eating well today, actually. But it's got to half two already, which I can't believe. Football pitch in here. A football cage or whatever. Put the pants on ice. I was bad like Mike. Oh, now I'm good like Kendra said. Boy, we gon' be alright. Oh, I just double my price. Yeah, I get love on sight. That's the only love I like. And look at that, we nice. For all the ones who showed it, showed up with no motives. That fake love is so bogus. I don't take love from false owners. Don't respect those who promote it. On paper, you look honest. On the outside, looking in. <laughs> So that was the end of the content for yesterday. It is now the day after. I am at the Apple Arms in Scotland, which has been incredible. You'll see a little bit of the breakfast and stuff in the next video. But yeah, ultimately, this has been a brilliant trip. Genuinely sad that it's the last day today, but I have really genuinely enjoyed it. So there's that. Um, this is this has been the Apple Arms. Probably the best hotel we went to over the four snow up there on the mountains as you can see if you have enjoyed these videos then be sure to leave a like share this around with your friends and obviously there'll be one more vlog today which i will start which will come out probably the day after this one so thanks a lot hope you enjoyed and i'll see you soon in a bit put the pants on ice i was bad like mike now i'm good